coast of Papua, it's a relief to think that nowadays the headhunters have left the seashore for the interior, and so we berth with the feeling that we're meeting friendly people on their own soil. Swimming comes natural to these brown-skinned kiddies, and they don't seem to mind the crocodiles that infest Papuan waters. The arrival of the boat from Sydney with its mails and stores is a red-letter day to the inhabitants. It's lucky that the climate is warm, but these huts would hardly keep out the cold of a southern winter. And now, let's take a peep at the children's playground. Oh yes, they have their sport here. The test bugs spread all over the world. They don't wear much, so there's plenty of leg theory. And budding Bradman sock them to leg. Here's a game that's mostly confined to boys in Australia, but it seems that in this village it's a feminine pastime. Some of you boys want to take a lesson from these girls and you'd clean the school up. Yeah, I think there's a bit of fudging going on, but the gallery holds its breath for the final shot. Yes, she's done it and scooped the pool. This spot is reserved for the boys and don't they love it. It's not quite a scenic railway, but these laughing kiddies with their simple tastes get as big a kick out of it as the city kid does on the slippery dip.